friends. It's a beautiful day. It is Sunday, and we was trying to find stuff to do today, but like I was saying, it's in the morning, so we decided. Oh, what was I saying? Oh, it's Sunday, so a lot of places aren't open today for like excursions and stuff. Um, so we're just gonna go to the pool and go. I mean, go to the pool, go to the beach, get some lunch. Yeah, it'd be a very calm day. I'm trying to clean my screen. Sorry to be all in your face. But. No. I got the original Omo Gaze on today. I've worn all three, well, three out of four styles. So. Yeah, we're gonna go to um, Palm Beach. It's another beach on the island. It's a nice day, it's very windy. It's very windy in Aruba. Ever since they've been here, it's been very, very windy. Which is good, because it's been humid, so I guess it balances out. But, how's everyone Sunday together today? I hope you all went to church today. Cause I didn't go to church today because I'm here, but I hope y'all still prayed for me. Cause why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Look at my skin. Boom. They're bringing them. Starting route to Palm Beach Plaza. Head north on Guayaca. Chinese restaurant right there. They have a KFC and a Domino's over there. A McDonald's over there. This is like American American Central. What? I could read your mind, gotta say that shit. Should I this, is my, this, is first, this is my first time seeing a stoplight here. Since we've been driving. Not that long, but like, everywhere else does not have stoplights. Yeah. Parking costs one dollar for a whole day. For a full day. By taking the side of the mall. Huh? This says one dollar for a full day. Next to the elevators. Where? Up there. You go up there? We have arrived at the Palm Beach Plaza. I'm gonna figure out where to get this token. The parking. Elevator, yeah. It's like a big, like, open mall. It's pretty dead over here. I wonder why. Maybe everything's not open? Because it's Sunday? What? Because oh, yeah. it's Sunday? Yeah, like Sunday. Yeah. Oh, right here. Should we get it now or should we get it after we come back? I guess it doesn't really matter. No, oh, because it, it needs to get out anyway, so. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's go. I mean, we're standing right here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You know? Give it a dollar. My, I have changed my wallet. Mm. We forgot today was Sunday, you know. This is only open on Sunday. Oh, right, till, till six. I wouldn't be a, this is one of the places I saw. Yeah. We'll be up, we'll open all day because like, it's location spot. Mm-hmm. But not no more. Huh? Not no more, because this is over. Yeah, exactly. Got Starbucks. Thank you, sorry. <laughs> 
That coleslaw is already not good. So adding raisins to it is already abomination. Mind you, that was supposed to be the side to this. Huh? Going back to regular life after vacation? Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's it's, it's awfully ratchet. It's awfully ghetto. The ghetto. Hmm. What? Oh. What happens when your kicks on fire? You can't wear your kicks on the grass, on the sand. There's a better job than starting at the same I'm gonna see where we can get towels. Oh, I hear. Oh, you didn't go to the one? I did, but like they have towels here. Oh, I lied. You need a ticket. Sick, we don't belong here. Mm. I don't even know, but we're taking this chair. Ugh. It's so nice out here. Just came off the beach. Uh, I'm a little tired. Hmm. Just went to the bathroom. It's not even our hotel. Oh yeah, what about yeah? Water right there. Oh, there was a tree right in front. I couldn't oh, see. That's how, that's how I was moving you closer because I knew you were blocked. Seems going well right now. Hmm? Seems going going crazy. How are they going? It's going great. <laughs> oh, because of fantasy football. Men. Men. So y'all, it's nighttime now. I couldn't record earlier because I realized I have no more space on my memory card. But I made space because I deleted some DC stuff. I forgot I put everything on my hard drive so I just should delete it off my camera but I ain't that smart. But this is Nixon's fit. Tell them who's sponsored the fit. You heard it first here. Oh, weather report. We're gonna get some food, bro. 
honestly, I thought that ice cream would make me feel full, but it's not. So, it's not bad. Because that's bare for a restaurant. That's the expensive one. That's the $4 sign one. Struggling, we finally found the spot. It's right at Never Beach. Like, this is pretty, they have a bit of pool too. Wow, wild. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. This is food menu and uh, drinks menu. Thank right? you. Thank you so much. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> Thank you. It's actually really nice. Are you, guys, are you guys a club at night too? Sorry? Are you guys a club at night too? Like no, no, no. Yeah, 10 o'clock. Oh, okay. Yeah, but today is a uh, busy day in the afternoon. Oh, yeah, yeah. Today's Sunday, yeah, so. Yeah. Which is good because we can get our stuff fast. We're very busy. <laughs> I'm gonna get the shrimp, jumbo shrimp and garlic sauce. He's going to get the filet mignon. Mm. Where's yours come with though? Rice. And rice. Oh, he's getting the filet mignon. I made the wrong thing. Rice and French fries. I believe mine is a very expensive part of the. It's a very customized. Well, I only needed $2 more. That's not my problem. They should have made it more expensive then. <laughs> nah, this is actually a cheap price for living. I told you once yesterday, I was like, yeah, this is pretty cheap. You know it's weird? Because Google says they close at 9, but this is at 10. We could have came yesterday. Honestly, if you don't have an all inclusive, it is going to be so hard for you to figure out what to eat here. Like, I think we did a good job. Well, I think I did a good job. I picked the places we've eaten. That's kind of cap. What's cap? We, we ate at Lucy's because when we stopped and asked <laughs> where to eat, so we Lucy's, turned around and Lucy's was don't like, count. Lucy's, Lucy's isn't <laughs> bad and we was right in front of Lucy's. Lucy's don't count. Lucy's did not count because the lady did not tell us thank you. Lucy's did not count. We got our food, we got my vegetables right here, my salad, my shrimp. Mason got his sirloin. I'll never understand why they give you food when it's not complete. What, what are you missing? The fries. Oh, your fries. I don't know. Interesting. I'll never Bring everything out. Bring it out complete. It's coming. She didn't, have, she didn't have two hands, bro. It's already done. I'm just saying. Complain, complain, complain. Yes. Enjoy. Thank you. Oh, he's, I think he's missing um, fries. Right. I ordered fries too. You ordered fries? Maybe the guy did it. Yeah, I'll check. Thank you. Sorry, she really didn't have two hands. That's all right, soon. Yeah, she made another hand to bring the wrong shit out. <laughs> oh, okay, next time. All right, y'all, I'm gonna go eat. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It's your girl. And it is Monday, December 16th. And we are still in Aruba. It's our last full day. Um, we woke up this morning, took a shower, got dressed. We're gonna go buy some ATVs um, with the natural pool. And yeah, right now Nick is just looking for his wallet. I think he left in the car. I hope he left in the car. So here we come to see if he got it. So yeah, it's our last full day. Is it in the car? Huh? Thank the Lord. You were, were you a little bit nervous? I was nervous for you. But yeah, so my hair is still wet. I just wet it. It's because yesterday the pool was very, very dry. So I like, washed it and put some curling. Curling smoothie. Curling something in my hair. I think I wanted to go get pancakes at this restaurant. But breakfast ends at 11.30. And it's currently 12 16. So we have to go to Denny's because he wants pancakes so bad. So yeah. Oh, we're supposed to be recording that. Huh? They got bowling in a movie theater. It's pretty cool. I think it's here. This place. This is it. Oh, really? I thought, yeah. 
Yeah, I think That's so. That's it, y'all. But in the event that y'all want to go where it's cheap and the food is good, mm -hmm. you go to walk and then you go to front of Playa Linda's mm -hmm. and there's the Carlitos. Okay, Carlitos. Smell good. They hamburgers as big as hubcaps <laughs> and they're $10 and they're good. Okay. And I'm from New York, so oh. you know I'm a funny right. person. <laughs> Thank you, Pam. Do you want to um, try pancakes here or you want to go to Denny's? Try it here. Try it here? Excited because you have finally a pancake. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, French toast, pancake, eggs, potatoes, bacon. Yo. I'm sorry. prayer to pray for my blessings for the new year lord i pray for blessings for me and my friends to pay to keep us safe no weapon formed against us shall prosper lord strengthen us protect us from danger protect us from evil more wealth more happiness more love amen Logically, like we're the only hotel that that way, kind of. But honestly, I saw where the um, restaurant is supposed to be, but I didn't see the restaurant itself. Sweet, you know that shit connected to the Wi-Fi is gonna be real quick. <laughs> <laughs> you know, let, let, let the tweet off. Phone started busting real quick. Like, <laughs> That's funny. I think every every place, every place, all the places today. We're closed earlier, now they're all open. I ain't show y'all earlier, but look at my girl Naomi. Boom. Again. Yeah, In case y'all didn't see her the first time. But, you know, got my cocktail. This is the view of the restaurant. I just water my lens. It's recording very, very weird. It's weird, thank you. I know I'm not close to y'all. I don't know what I was looking at, but look at that. My camera's gonna die. 17%. 
Because I always put the charger. My other batteries are every else house. Every if you're watching this, in my battery. Hey, did you win? There's one more game today. Oh, isn't it like seven o'clock? Yeah, it's a Monday night football game. If you're watching this, it'll be over by now, but wish Nixon good luck. <laughs> she said she was going to come back. She came to offer you some cheese. Oh. Yeah, she says she'll come back. Oh. I'm so full, y'all. But that was the best chicken alfredo, well, shrimp alfredo I've ever had. Ever. Anywhere. Everywhere. I'm still just getting ice cream right now. I'm at the McDonald's. Right there. See it? The McDonald's thing. Oh, I gotta sit down. Hopefully, let's sit down. I feel like I'm pregnant. I'm big bellied and everything. Uh. How's your fudge? Ice cream looks like different. It's like frozen yogurt. Oh, it's seeping through. Yeah. She gave you extra, extra. I don't know why she would be that sloppy. She looks sloppy. Like, why would you, like, you know, like, someone's walking around. Why would you, like, oh, feel, feel it like, that. like that? It just doesn't make sense. Yeah, and they don't have the top. Like, at least at McDonald's, they have the top. Yeah. So they like, yeah. It's not like I'm going home, like. Such a dripping. Actual chocolate. It's not fudge. It's like chocolate chocolate. Chocolate. My com my computer. My camera's gonna die. It's on six percent. And I only have 14 minutes left on my memory card. So I'm gonna talk to y'all. I ain't gonna say it tonight because I don't promise nothing. But definitely in the morning. So if you don't see me, a couple minutes, and it ain't dark outside. Just know, it ain't the night no more. Good morning, friends. Like I said last night, I don't talk to y'all, and it's bright outside. It's the morning. So last night, we was talking about Nixon and Fantasy, and let them know. Did you win? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes. Let's go. And my twin nieces were born this morning. So, just a great day for both of us, you know? I got my nieces, he got his, he's in the championship. And we're going home, which is not a good thing, but it's sad, but it's like, it is what it is, you know? We've experienced it. But we're about to go to Palm Beach one last time, get some food, walk around, and then head back to the old R.I. Y'all are probably like, bitch, what the fuck? It's okay. I just came to interrupt y'all to tell you what happened and why I'm on my webcam and not in Aruba. So our travel back from Aruba was very, very stressful. Like, so much shit went down. Like, not like crazy shit, but like, so much inconvenience happened. Um, when we got there, it took us like an hour and a half to just get, like, into, like, the terminal so when you go to Aruba it is out of country so in US customs you have to go through the scanning thing once and then you have to like check your bags in your luggage extra luggage in and then you have to pick up the luggage again take you and your and your luggage into customs and they get the scan again and then you go through like the scanning thing second time so you drop your bags off and then pick up your bags up again so that's already like a process in itself and then getting through the line to get to US customs to get like your passport checked and your picture taken was another 30 minutes so we almost missed our plane like thank god for like you know us being like in the last group whatever took time but then that's not even what happened that's not even the worst that happened we got to our gate and then as soon as we got to get on the plane it gets alert saying oh our flight from new york home we're going from maruba to new york to boston our flight from to new york got delayed till the next morning at six in the morning mind you it's three o'clock 
six in the morning to the next whole next day. So we would be stuck in New York, which is not a bad thing because we could literally like, you know, like drive home if he didn't want to wait till like the next flight or whatever, whatever. But we was like, that's fucked up because he was just getting on the plane. So what if we didn't get the notification and we're on the plane and we're deserted? You know, think, what if we didn't have money to get a car or to get home? Or, you know, you know what, what if, you know? So then we realized that we have another flight after us going to Atlanta. So we could take the Atlanta flight and go home to Boston from Atlanta. So we still get home around the same time as we get home on a New York flight, which is okay. Good God. Oh, God. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. Yeah, great. But our bags are already on this New York flight. So we're like, yo, yes, good plane ticket, but our bags. Like, what's going to happen with our bags? So we go to the lady, we're like, yeah, this is what's happening. Thank God. She was like, at first she was like, I'm not sure if I can get your bags because we're already almost done boarding. I'm like, sis, like, it's legit an orange bag. We have one bag. We took in one bag. Like, this right away. Sorry, everyone on the plane, but I didn't get home. Just like you. So she was like, oh, yeah, they haven't finished loading the bags yet, so we're going to try to get your bags. I said, thank you, Lord, bitch. Try. I'm going to call her a bitch because she's really nice about it. But she got our bags for us, which is cool. And then... Traveling home, it was just a lot, you know, I didn't feel like vlogging no more at that point, I was very, you know, I'm I'm very, I don't know, I had like a panic attack, Nixon was very calm about everything, I'm just like, bitch, what if you don't get home, I would just know, I, we would have got home, but I don't like inconveniences like that, especially like, after going through all that custom shit, I, I just didn't like the fact that we had to like, go through all that too, like, which is like a disaster type of disaster, which honestly, like, I think a lot that it was anything bad, because we got home safely, but like, at that moment, it was like the world ending around me. So, so I want to do and tell y'all that's what happened. I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. My next vlog will be coming soon because I am going on a trip next week. Today is January 8th that I'm uploading this video, and I'll be going on my trip on January 18th. I won't be telling you where I'm going, you should have to see because that's what I'm doing this year. This year, I'm just popping up on trips, and y'all just gonna see. Shoot, gonna be like, damn girl, like, can I come with you? And if you're serious about coming on trips to me, if you live in Rhode Island, if you live anywhere, we can just meet up. But like, if you really wanna hang out with the, the cool kids, you know where to find me at. But I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. Thank you for watching. Thank you for staying too. I know it was two long vlogs, but I had so much to show and I didn't want to cut everything out. So thanks for supporting me. Peace, love, and everything above.